Hello, you guys. It's me, Taylor. Today's Friday. Happy Friday. Um, I wanted to show you guys what I've been up to and what I recently got. So, I went to the, my local library and I was like, I gotta get this again. So, you guys have actually seen these two before and like a long, long time ago vlog. And I had this when I was kind of trying to learn Korean but I just didn't know kind of thing and I kind of gave up in a sense but I was like after I had got this one and looked at the book it comes with I was like oh my gosh I get it now or majority of it so in this like thing this auto book audio book you get two CDs the first CD has units one through five and then the second one has units six through thirteen and then you get like the little booklet or whatever. So in the book, they give you uh, what is kind of like some history about what a Korean and Hangul. And in the back, they have like um, questions they ask you. You have to figure them out. They have vocabulary, which is great. Uh, they have little questions, like little stories and like different chapters you have to figure out and then they also have like um how to put kind of how to put the hangul together in sentences so this is this book or this like audio book is for or generally used for so this one and this this one over here says for speaking listening reading and writing and then this one is it says spoken world Korean and this is my like I said second time getting this book uh, excuse me sorry had an alarm set um so this one you get a lot more CDs uh, just because uh, you do just because <laughs> so you have one two three four five and six you get six CDs with this one and you also get the book and inside this book it's a little bit skinnier than that one but uh, you get like the map over here and it gives you um, now this says it's for complete beginners so but I would recommend getting both of them if they are available to you so this kind of breaks it down to like different lessons so the first lesson is how are you saying hello uh second lesson is where is the movie theater how much so this gives you more like um the talking part of korean in a sense the speaking part even though the other one does like gives you some like pointers and things like that i feel like you can use this one more when it comes to speaking like this is just like learning grammar and the basic stuff you just basically need to know that one is and then this is just using it for real like well the yeah I can't it's hard to explain so they give you the Korean alphabet and if this will focus you can see it but generally that's what it is um, like I said, now this one does give you like extra stuff, the double consonants, uh, pure vowels, you know, all that kind of stuff that you, that the other book, I feel like it doesn't do that, but yeah. So then it tells you how, so like, uh, I was reading earlier and, um, and I can't remember where it's at, but it just tells you how you put the words together in a like the hangul practice is right here so it says write out the hangul for the syllables below so they give you like these little things right here and then you take a piece of paper and write it out and see how you did and also they have you write either and then you can follow the sentences write them out and they give you the answer key right after so just to check your work and then they do like little warm-ups for each like um lesson and they give you what should what does this word mean this word mean and whether it's formal or polite or excuse me informal or polite and just things like that and you get a lot of 
grammar plus vocabulary plus how to put things in a sentence and how it, how it's going to look and it also gives you vocabulary words I believe at the end yep and they have like different answer keys because this book does have like little questionnaires after each chapter so this is really good um, and both books kind of require you to kind of follow along and I recommend that because then you can be like wait that didn't make sense like I've been uh lately I've been uh, trying to figure out what I've been I don't know I just can't even explain now <laughs> right so then I also got these two books now I have or these three books I have no idea what they say um I know it doesn't make any sense but these two books I got I was like they kind of remind me they could be like children related I guess just because I was attracted to like the colors and things like that plus like inside of this book and if you guys know what this says, could you put it down below? Uh, so this book, I was like, oh, I should get this book. Because I liked how the writing looked in it, the hangul. And it looked like I can actually probably figure it out. That's why I got this book also. Um, and this one, I got it because the colors, I mean, that's basically like kid colors. And it looks like that's candy. Or like lollipops or something. I wasn't sure. Um... So like this one is kind of like it seemed more children-y I guess children's book but it seems simple but it seemed hard at the same time but uh and it's like literally I feel like this is like a chapter book that's been like put with pictures basically right it has bad things in it um yeah so yeah if I, I feel like this is like a chapter book that's just been added with pictures and stuff like that so this book I got it because I really like these flowers on it and I'm like I said I don't know what it says uh yet in a sense but I like this because it reminded me of like a journal because it has like this little string part right here so I was like maybe this is like uh some type of journal related uh book or like the writing of someone's you know perspective of something so I was like let me get this book so those are all for Korean now I did pick up this one that's for Chinese because I was like maybe I should learn more Chinese I've been looking online for some like basic uh, learning the tones and things like that so that's where I've been learning my Chinese from for right now but I know like the basics basics of basics Chinese so this one you get you don't get a booklet but you get three cds or discs uh, and they just tell you i listened to it the other day and it basically was saying you know what is they say it in english and they say it in mandarin chinese so you don't really get like a descript descriptive type of you know learning with this but you do get like your listening skills goes up so yeah, and that's all I have for you guys today. So, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. I'll see you guys on the flip side. And peace. Peace. Or V. Uh, either way. Bye-bye. <laughs> um,